and he's going up against Armand Rossell, the Sabu brawler. And if you take a look at his physical build, you know a while because Rossell is a is a is a brawler. But yeah, there's Pacquiao with a good combination. Rossell looked a little bit of trouble there. Well, maybe Pacquiao is not like a Tarona. Yes. Oh, now they're fighting from close range. Oh, this is left-right yes. combination by Rossell. Pacquiao comes back, and Pacquiao did oh, connect he, with a he, nice, beautiful left from under. A couple of low lows there by Rossell. Pacquiao connected with a good punch from under. Now it's, covering it, up. it's interesting, Ronnie, that both of these fighters are southpaws. They're both left-handers, and both of them are connecting from close range. But Armand Rossell, this is the kind oh, of yes, fight he, he likes. He is connecting solidly Pacquiao, from close range. Pacquiao making a mistake of going in. He's getting yes. clubbed. Pacquiao and Rossell really going after each other. Pacquiao connects with good right. Rossell was in a little bit of trouble against the ropes there. But he comes in with a hard right from under. And Pacquiao has got him against the ropes. And it's a slugfest now. Pacquiao and Rossell just slugging it out in the center of the ring. Now Rossell, Rossell is, is going down. Pacquiao Rossell is hurt. He's hurt. But he comes back with a hard right of his own. And Pacquiao is going after Rossell. And that's... Rossell goes in, Pacquiao dances off the ropes very nicely, but now Rossell nails him against the ropes once again, has him against the ropes. Pacquiao oh, yes. connects with a beautiful looping right hand. Rossell is fighting back. The thing with Pacquiao is he's getting a little careless. He really wants to knock this guy out. Now yes. he connects with a couple of good he punches. Wants, he wants to create a big intention. Yes, here. beautiful he left. Put, he wants to put Rossell down on the canvas. Pacquiao, thundering right hand. Clubbing left and a right from under. Good straight right by Pacquiao. Left from under again, but Rossell is fighting back. Pacquiao has him in the neutral corner. Rossell and Rossell is in trouble. It looks yes. like he's going down. Rossell, Rossell has very little defense to speak of. And he's wide open as he comes in. And Pacquiao is certainly taking advantage. He's but Rossell is fighting back. Left from under and a right cross. Another left and a right by Pacquiao. Rossell comes back with the left of his own. Nails Pacquiao, but Pacquiao with a right cross. He's got Rossell against the ropes. He's working with the body and switching to the head. You know, what makes Pacquiao a double threat is that uh, while he's fighting on the southpaw stance, he packs a very powerful right-hand punch. Rossell, but he connects with a good right. Well, he did throw. Another hard right. An enormous volume of punches. And here we go again. Pacquiao. Good short right. But he nearly lost his mouthpiece, then throws the left from under in the neutral corner. Rossell fighting back, but Pacquiao working to the body. Good left again by Pacquiao. Left uppercut, Rossell against the ropes, in the corner, he's in trouble. Pacquiao nails him with a long looping right. And another left. They're really slugging it out, but Rossell is getting a bad beating from Pacquiao here. Pacquiao, the crowd's roaring on his yes. feet. The crowd is on his feet. Finally down. And referee Look at this crowd. Right. Look at this crowd. Giving him the count, Rossell is still down. Look at that nasty lump he, on his right eye. Out. I'm not it's sure over. if Rossell is going, getting up. No, he has been counted out. Galiza has counted up to 10. Rossell has lost by a knockout. But only one loss. That was in the hands of Rustico Torricampo when he was knocked out. You know, he's a very popular fighter. Yeah. All, all, everywhere we go, they, they ask for Manny Pacquiao. But he's young. He's, he's colorful. And he keeps uh, busy yes. inside the ring. Except that I, I understand he's, he's, you know, he's a great fighter, but he, he tends to get ill from time to time. In fact, he was supposed to fight some some weeks ago, but couldn't fight because he was ill, and uh, that's why he's fighting tonight. Combination is being unleashed now by Manny Pacquiao. And right to the body. Pacquiao, hey, oh, good right to that face of Luna. He's going after Luna. Oh, there he goes. Down. There he goes. Flurry of punches delivered here by Manny Pacquiao. I don't think he's going to no. get up. No, he's not going to get up. He's not boxing. It's over. Yes. Big first round knockout victory here by Manny Pacquiao to the delight. several world title fights. He's in there to control the action and Manny Pacquiao versus Wu Ki Lee. Interestingly, this, yes. both have 17 wins and one loss. That's true. Very, very, or almost identical uh, records, but uh, Wu Ki Lee has three draws to his uh, name also. Wu Ki Lee in the kind of cream uh, trunks with the red down the side. Pacquiao in you know, purple. Manny Pacquiao fighting flat-footed at this stage. 
Papel trying to create southpaw. some tempo that uh, with a right hand. He's the southpaw. Wookie Lee speaks in the right. Pacquiao is, you know, is one of the most popular fighters in the country today. He's certainly a flamboyant yes, boxer with a big punch. He's very, very charismatic. And I think he's going out uh, for the kill right here on the opening bell. Pacquiao really. Oh, he shows dropping. absolutely no respect for the Korean. Wookie Lee goes down through the ring, through the ropes. And I think that might have been a body shot. Yes, it was. A body shot and... Uh, Wookie Lee, I think, is just going to sit this one out. We're not even one minute into the fight. It's and over. that's it. It's over. Wookie Lee took a punch. To the side of the body he might have broken his ribs. He is in deep trouble in his, in his, in his corner. You see, that was hard left to the body. Yeah. That was that one punch to the body. And he's just about to crumple right here. But also, you notice that the Korean absolutely had no defense. Oh, flush right on the cross. button that time. The left hand, a series of left hands actually, but that, there was a left hand that hit him. With instruction from uh, the third man in the ring, Cody. Stands. Left by Pacquiao to the face of Chok Chai. You know, one thing about Manny Pacquiao is that he puts his guy so dangerously low, yes. and he's wide open for the counter attack of Chok Chai battery, but here he is on the attack. He's got to be a little more careful in going towards Chok Chai battery, who is a very dangerous fighter. Every punch that he's thrown, whether it's solid or not. Well, you notice that uh, Chok Chai is not initiating the action at all. He's waiting for counter punch. Uh -huh. He's waiting for the opening, and he's waiting for Pacquiao to come in. And Pacquiao obliges. He comes straight in at Chok Chai CK battery. Oh, I guess. And the only attack is being rounded by Battery Pacquiao. Chokai 3K battery trying to hang on. And Barry Pacquiao is still at it. Chokai 3K battery trying to ride off the blows. Battery took the direction of Barry Pacquiao. Another right to the face by Barry Pacquiao. Angles to throw his straight and, and hook. Chokai goes to the body and now to the face. Barry Pacquiao countering. Pacquiao with the right and the left. Up in his punches, and you can Oh, good right there by Manny Pacquiao. Well, Manny Pacquiao is now engaging Chuck Chai 3K battery in some with a punching match. Well, this is a big gamble in his start. Yeah, and he's gaining in confidence here. Well, he has hit Chuck Chai several times, and now he tries to go test of stamina for Manny Pacquiao, whether he can uh, continue with his pace of moving around and both fighters wrestling each other down in the canvas. Well, Manny Pacquiao led off with the left that hit the face of uh, Chuck Chai, but that was obviously a slip. And Manny Pacquiao immediately goes to work with a right-left combination to the face of Chuck Chai. Good left to the right by Manny Pacquiao. Oh, good miss by Manny Pacquiao to the face. Caught him twice at the right side of the head. It's down, and I don't think he's going to get up. He doesn't look too good. Down for the count, and Pacquiao. A fifth round knockout by Manny Pacquiao of the Philippines with a good left to the side of the face of Chokchai 3K battery. And 3K battery is still wincing in pain. As we see him slump in his corner. Oh, unbelievable ending here. Lucian and Alice Mandaloon, tinalo niya si Chuk Chai Battery. Tama, oh. fifth round knockout. Although pare yung laban na yun. Number one is underway, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. Well, Pacquiao is a fighter in the red trunks, and uh, the Thai, Sing Wan Cha, is in the white trunks. Both of them are southpaws. Of course, Pacquiao likes to go for an early knockout. He's a... He's got a record of 21 wins, uh, 13 by KO. He lost only once, and uh, he hasn't drawn a fight. So he's a very, very aggressive fighter. Well, he's already at it, Ronnie. And um, the crowd here already loving the uh, action that they've seen so far. He's leading off with his right. But uh, Sing Wang Chao also connects with his right of his own. Yes, Ma Manny Pacquiao waiting for the right and then the left. But the Thai caught him with a good right. Ronnie, Manny unfortunately, ito ang kumukuha ng katawan si Manny Pacquiao dahil... Uh -huh. 
I uh, expected the tie to go for the body, uh, having learned from his... Uh, Pacquiao, correction, that was beautiful left. Left-right combination there by Manny Pacquiao, he's and he's trying to go for the kill. Yes, he connect, connect with a good left uppercut, and Sing Wan Cha is in a little bit of trouble. Pacquiao going after him. You know, it's a very hot afternoon, and you... I hope this boy doesn't punch himself out. He's got to put Sing Wan Chai away early. Well, Sing Wan Chai himself is uh, full of heart, Ron. He's, he's getting hit, but he is also hitting back. Ma malalakas yung binibitawan ni Pacquiao. Nakita mo yung kung paano mag-snap yung ulo ni yung uh, nung tayo, no? Ito, Sing Wan Chai. Medyo na yung hilo na, Reka. Ano na, kinukuha sa katawan na. Come on. Ayun na. Wala na, kinukuha sa katawan eh. Well, Manny Pacquiao was hitting almost at will. Sing Wan Chai trying gamely as Bruce McTavish, the referee, counts him out. It's all over. Oh, spectacular first round win by Manny Pacquiao. And look at the crowd. Adoring hometown uh, or townmates here in Coronadal, South Cotabato. And look at the crowd. He wins seven losses, one draw. Ito po sa gitna ng ring, medyo parang hindi gigit. Ito si Manny Pacquiao. Pagkakit si Manny Pacquiao. Parang pinakita ni Gabriel Mira that he's going to stand up and fight this fight. And it's going to be the better man who's going to win and who's going to end up standing. Ooh, great left by Manny Pacquiao to the face of Gabriel Mira. At meron tayong nakita ng left upper shot na pumakit. Mga apat na pulgada siguro ito si Manny Pacquiao kay Gabriel. Gabriel Mira. O oh, fighter ito si Manny Pacquiao para iniintay niya pumasok ito si Gabriel Mira. He's going to Uy, good luck. Long time. Hindi pa pasok ito si Mira. He's got to move in. Pero nakita mo yung mga sitok ni Manny Pacquiao ay eh, puro baka malalakas eh. No? Pero fighter, kwidaw dapat ito si Manny yeah. Pacquiao. Tinatamaan siya pagpasok niya. Oh. And it looks like he's a little hurt here. He got hurt. At si Manny Pacquiao ngayon is moving away and he has to play. He's here in round number two. Oh, good combination there by... Manny Pacquiao on the left. Oh, he's going. Gabriel Mira is going to come on left by Manny Pacquiao in round number two. He is dazed. And he's slow to get up. But a wise little to Mira. He doesn't have to to my own. The referee Richard Steele. Yes, and oh, he goes out again. And sabi ni Richard Steele, tumulong ka na one bell. So, so good na. So good si Manny Pacquiao. So good, so good. At the start of round number three, Gabriel Mira trying to stem the tide here. Oh, good left again by Manny Pacquiao. And another one. Fighter ito si Manny Pacquiao. Gusto niya nang tapusin na. Oh. Ah, kaya ito lang mga taktika. Sinabi ko kanina, ito si Mira. Isa sa kagalingan ito. Magaling maslint ito. Oh. Kinawa na naman. Oh. He's hanging on. He's hanging on. Nakakatara pa na ito si Gabriel Mira. And Manny Pacquiao. Mira pa yun. Mira. Mira pa yun na siya ni Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao clearing away. Gabriel Mira trying to fight back. Oh, look at those lefts being delivered by Manny Pacquiao. But Mira trying to fight back. Right, a little right to the face by Manny Pacquiao. Hinahawakan na si Manny Pacquiao. Oh, he's perfect. Tumagtak na. At sabi ni Richard Steele. That's it now. Hinahawak. Hinahawakan na si Manny Pacquiao. At hindi binibigyan ng warning ni Richard Steele. Oh, he's nakatama si Mira doon. Sugod na sugod si Manny Pacquiao. Oh, ano ito? Ano ito? Richard still asking him to get up. Oh, this is his hanging up with his life. Fighter, I think Reverend Richard still has lost control of this fight. Baba na kaibigan. Nagpapahinga ito si Gabriel. Oh, oh. By going down on the floor, it is calling a slip. It's an intentional 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 slip. Tries to fight back. Manny Pacquiao scoring a goal at the robbery leg side of Gabriel Mira. Manny Pacquiao still bouncing on Gabriel Mira. Mira vainly trying to fight back. Well, that is. Sa amin na sukat at tinanggap ni Mira. Game pa rin. Ano ito? Bibilangan niya dapat. Ano ito? Bibilangan niya dapat. Bibilangan niya dapat. Ano ba ng plastic? Ayan, bibilangan niya dapat. Wala na, mukhang pagod na pagod na si Gabriel Mira. Mamalambot na ang tuhod. Pastor, kung binilangan yung ibang mga slip zone at knockdown, this is all over because it's a three knockdown rule. I cannot believe. Oh, another right. By Manny Pacquiao. This is only the third round, mga kaibigan. Ang ating world chat. Ula na na siya ng sutok. Here comes Manny Pacquiao again. Forty minutes left. Another left. Manny Pacquiao stalking his... Oh! Good left against the chip! Right back on the 
Sergio. Oh, Gabriel Mira. And he slowly walked back to his corner. He did it on the referee Richard Steele. To Gabriel Mira. This is round number four. Oh, he's down the he gets up at the count of nine. Parter, the three knockdowns is in And Manny Pacquiao is going for it. Dito sa round yeah. na to. to Gabriel Mira. Isa na lang. Yeah, yakap na yakap to Gabriel Mira. Kahit dito na sito. Manny Pacquiao. He can sense. Oh. And he now has to be Pacquiao. It's a knockdown na lang. He was down to see Gabriel Mira. Try to fight back. Now the guy has to let him go. Sending it to see Manny Pacquiao. Oh. He can check the check. He can check the Gabriel Mira. And Mira is tying him up. Right to the face of Gabriel Mira. Another left. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's it. Marupilio again digging the into section. the midsection. Talagang gusto gusto niya yung oh. portion na yun. Ayun na naman siya. Mukhang uh, may nasasaktan si uh, Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao is Manny. feeling the pain. Yeah. No? Talagang nararamdaman niya yung uh, kita mo, tumatakbo siya. No? Oh, nasaktan He's si hurt. Marupilio, Manny. Yes. Manny Pero, Pacquiao. Kumounter siya. Marupilio comes back. This is wrong. Tinaman din si Manny doon. Nakounter lang din. Masuntok ni Manny Pacquiao. Marupilio has a world-class chin. Mukhang uh, sinasay ko si Manny dito, Governor. Yes, Manny Pacquiao pursuing Barotilio. He knows that Barotilio is hurt. And he goes! Down! 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 For the first time in this fight, Barotilio is down. This is the first time Bruce he's ever been down. down. Is giving him a mandatory eight count. Barotilio is willing to continue. I thought, oh, that's the end of the round. This is the fourth round. Barutilio in red, Manny Pacquiao in white. Third man in the ring, Bruce Nakhtani. Oh, good. Right. Magandang right yun sa midsection. Midsection of Arnold Barutilio. Arnold oh. Barutilio is hurt. And I think he is going to go down any moment soon. His legs are wobbly, oh, but oh. he connects so with a good speak. right to the face of Manny Pacquiao. Hindi pwedeng magkumpiyansa si Manny Pacquiao. Medyo tinamahan si Manny doon. Tinamahan si Manny Pacquiao ngayon. Oh! That was a delayed reaction. A delayed reaction. And Bruce McDavis ends the fight. We're coming to you live from the Marfori Heights, the Rizal Memorial College's gym. And Rocket Gym back home. Shaking off the punches.
Saga is next. Punch stat numbers from preceding fights. In the first fight, as you can see, Pacquiao threw many more punches, but Morales landed many more punches. The second fight, Pacquiao again threw more punches. In that fight, he landed more punches. The first round to Manny. Pacquiao crowd chanting Manny, Manny, Manny. Morales, who landed some good right hands in the first fight, tried to drive Pacquiao back with right hands there, but Manny comes back with a torrent of punches from his own. You have ardent spirited Mexican and Mexican American Morales Rooters sitting next to and among ardent spirited Filipino and Filipino American Rooters for Pacquiao. Sturdy as compared to Morales. Even though Morales is landing, he seems to be still uncoordinated as compared to. Down goes Morales on a Pacquiao right hand. Left. 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 And, and, and Morales thought that he had Pacquiao in the. Uh, yeah, uh, just... he, he got over excited. Overextended himself and left himself open. I just don't think he has the strength that is stamina to hold over Pacquiao. That was the fourth time in his career that Eric Morales has been knocked down. Two of them were in the last fight against Pacquiao, and they led ultimately to the end of the fight. The first knockdown of Morales' career was a glove-touching brush with the canvas against Marco Antonio Barrera in the 12th round of their first fight. never exactly been thunderously put on his back, but he goes down easier against Pacquiao than against anybody else he's ever fought. That's because of how quick Pacquiao's fists are, and he doesn't see the punches coming, Jim. Pacquiao again landing his straight left hand. Morales chases him and lands a right. They trade punches at the rope. And when they trade punches, Morales takes a damn Loves it. And unlike some punchers, man, he does have head movement. Yeah, that was, a, it was almost really missing of a little error and proud. He punched the body and then comes up on top. Eric Morales, not a... Some men walk over hot coals. A right hook, a punch that... Hard right hand, hand stunned Morales. Pacquiao's all over him. Thinks he's got a chance. He, he Morales slightly staggered after that last left hand. And down he goes. Solid left hand shot by yeah. Pacquiao, who did not like Morales saying that he didn't hurt him with punches in the second fight. Pacquiao was insulted by that. Yeah. He said, okay, I'll hurt him this time. But he's a fighter. He's going to fight still. He's not going to try what, to run. What, is, what is the referee doing? Why is he holding he's the fight? He's going to go back to the neutral corner. <laughs> oh, what a solid left hand by Pacquiao. It's hard to but, imagine but, how Morales can last long against this. Well, until he goes out, he's going to be fighting all the way down. He's not going to back up. What guts by Morales! Yes. He strafes Pacquiao with right hands, even while on unsteady feet. And he is hurt. And he holds on for one of the first times in his career. He 30 seconds to go. Another huge left hand by Pacquiao. Punch after punch after punch. And he wants to finish Morales right here. And the brave heart of Morales holds up, but his legs go again. Third knockdown of the fight by Pacquiao against Morales. He doesn't want to get Morales takes his head as if to say, I want no more. That is that. The fight. For our main event, and let's check out how they match up. Andy Pacquiao, the lefty, with a height disadvantage, though interestingly his reach is almost the same as Jorge Solis.
exciting and excellent fighter. He makes a lot of fundamental errors. He squares himself oh. up to opponents. He lunges in. But it is very hard for even the elite fighters. Uh, and he is 3-1-1 one, one against the, the Eric Morales's, uh, Juan Manuel Marquez, and Marco Antonio Rivera. Hard for them even to take advantage of it. Solis is a very awkward fighter for Pacquiao to deal with right now. Yeah, the, the height has actually been a problem for Pacquiao. Uh, the movement. I mean, people who see Pacquiao fight should realize and understand that he has a little, a lot of trouble with fighters that move. Both hitting Pacquiao hard and often. So right. he's just kind of picking his shots. Nice left hand by Pacquiao. May have stunned Solis. We'll see. Another left hand by Pacquiao. The harder punch is probably being landed by Pacquiao. What lands? Solis. Just seconds remaining here in round five. This has been a pretty good round for Jorge Solis. And that's the understatement. Though he's probably still behind in this fight. He's making some things happen against Manny Pacquiao. So there's blood on the eye doesn't mean they... Oh, good. Straight right. Now remember, as this fight wears on, especially as we get through this round, if that cut would cause a stoppage in this fight because it was a clash of heads and they bang heads again, it would... Oh, there's a left hand that sends Solis down. Oh, oh, so they're a push. Push. they're calling it a push. push. They had to. Oh, big right hook by Pacquiao. A left hand, and Solis is in some trouble. And there goes a push by Pacquiao. He's trying to muscle his way in. Solis has been hurt here in the sixth round. Excuse me, I said the fifth. I meant the sixth. This is now the Pacquiao that I think everybody expected to see. And this is what I expected to see of Solis right here, trying to avoid, trying to get away from punches, and getting hurt because he doesn't pick up his hands. That clash of heads and the cut over the eye woke up Manny Pacquiao. He is a tiger here in round six, and Jorge Solis is in trouble. Solis just ripping shots on the inside. And again, I think they... So Solis has a tendency to fall inside, especially if he throws his right hand, and that's why the head's coming again. Two I left hands hurt Solis. Right. Two good straight left hands got him in trouble again. Pacquiao's primary weapon, and it's working now. So Solis needs to pick up that guard. He needs to <laughs> land and uh, do lots of damage. Round eight, Al Bernstein along with Wally Matthews and Gennaro Hernandez, former junior lightweight champion of the world. And uh, we're happy that you joined us for what's been a very entertaining evening of boxing. And this main event has had some plots and subplots. A clash of heads created a cut uh, in round six over the eye of Manny Pacquiao. Uh, they have controlled it for the most part. And in the last two rounds, Pacquiao has been extremely effective against Jorge Solis. You know, and I think they've run out of ideas in Solis's corner. Yeah. Gennaro, you know, we <laughs> up listening, and uh, they've invoked the uh, the family. He's in trouble, and down goes Solis. You know, like it was that lip up with that drop. He's not going to make it. He's not going to make it. Ocho, nueve. Oh, he does get up at nine. At nine. That was a surprise. How much longer can he continue? A lot of time left in this round, of course. There goes that up again again. He's hurt. He's out. Oh, it's it. It's, it's over. over. Solis sent down for the second time. Cinco. He is yes. on the Siete. apron of the ring. Ocho. Nueve. He's not the yes. He's not the it's an advance and very relieved, I think, to, to get this. And apparent ability to move up and down among weight levels with ease. Against the rough and tumble, face first fighting style of Hatton. Will Hatton have enough greater strength and size to knock out or outpoint Pacquiao? We are about to find out. Pacquiao versus Hatton. After a long publicity tour and a lot of exposure to each other, they are genuinely friendly. They like each other. It should not show up in the fight. No. So Hatton wants to apply pressure, but with care, yes, with against care. Pacquiao's faster yes. hands. Yes. And I think he's doing just that. Hard right hand by Pacquiao. Trying to hit Hatton as he comes in. Key element of the game plan for Pacquiao. Allow Hatton to come forward, catch him on the way in. A key element of the game plan for Hatton, get Pacquiao against the ropes, just like that. Pacquiao has been more successful with the right than the left. That, that punch missed. There's the right again landing. 
Quick right hooks are landing for Pacquiao. The left hand is overshooting the target. It's going to be an important factor to see how Kitty Bayless handles this fight because it could be exciting and it could end up being a very wrestling type match also. Great right hand for Hatton glazed across the face. And oh, Pacquiao. Pacquiao's Pacquiao. face is already red. I thought Pacquiao landed the right hook. Well, I think Pacquiao's landed three significant right hooks already in the fight, Emmanuel. Well, follows the jab with a hook, comes back with another jab. There's the straight left hand, and he landed it right on Hatton's chin. And down goes Hatton after he swings and misses with a left hook. And that's a knockdown for Manny Pacquiao. Perfect right hand inside. Well, I don't know if Vicky's going to survive. I, you know, I'm surprised to see him get hurt for Shelly. But you know, he's not the type of a guy that goes out to survive. He's a fighter. Hatton got a couple of extra seconds as Bayless tried to back Pacquiao off. Pacquiao was coming out of the neutral corner in a hurry. Lands another right hook. Pacquiao's hands are so back. Pacquiao's hands are blindingly fast. His hands are so fast that no opponent sees the punches coming. A very Another perfect up. right hand for Pacquiao. Another right hook. Straight left hand. Pacquiao's landing at Will. Hard left hand. Hatton has to hold on. Will Hatton make it out of the round? He's down for the second time. This is the brilliance of the Filipino slugger. A tsunami for Manny Pacquiao in round one. Here's the first knockdown, Emmanuel. Right, right hook as he was coming. He never saw it. And what's amazing to see him land a punch and then slip a punch all at the same time shows unbelievable coordination. The issue has always been and timing. whether Hatton could get to Pacquiao and avoid these kinds of clean punches. CompuBox numbers in round one utterly devastating to Pacquiao's chances. Hard left hand by Hatton. Ricky has decided to fight fire with fire. And it's what he's going to have to do in this case, Sherry, he just is try to smother this guy and get close. He's trying to punch at a certain distance. Whoa, whoa, Pacquiao no, 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 is actually no, no, just no, too no, sharp no. and accurate to punch him. The physical strength is still with Hatton, but the, the, the punch is still Pacquiao. Hard left hand by Pacquiao. Stunned Hatton and knocked him back. Look at the brilliant accuracy of Manny Pacquiao. Landing with both right and left hands. Misses the right hook there. What Ricky needs to do is to smother him. He cannot see to be able to punch. You need to push him just what he's doing there. Good left hook inside by Hatton. And then he closed down Pacquiao's left side. Hard right hand again by Pacquiao. Ricky can't see the hook coming. In Hatton's most famous victory over Costa Zoo, he just smothered him and didn't allow him to get off. He can't seem to be able to get close enough to Pacquiao often enough to do that. And Costa Pacquiao's Zou. hands are so quick. That's the point. Costa Zoo had about a quarter of the speed of Manny Pacquiao. Pacquiao's, it's Pacquiao's blinding speed that sets him apart. As well as his head movement. His head movement is just a phenomenon. I don't think he's landing too much out of that exchange, but it's just his, his ability to punch, maintain balance, which he used to couldn't do. And his head, head movement is just too difficult for Hatton to time. I think Pacquiao may have spent the first two minutes of this round thinking knockout and allowed himself to get a little wild. Now he goes back to more precision. Yeah, lands but, a hard body shot. But Ricky isn't moving his head too much still. Uh, his head is still like that. What a straight left hand. And will Hatton make it up from this? Can he beat the count? Is that it? And Kenny Bayless says, no way. And Take a look at this. Take a look at this. This is a perfect time. That and was it, super slow yeah, motion. Yeah, and he never saw a time him coming in. Yeah. It's the first time he's knocked out somebody like this since he was at 130 pounds. And Hatton's head hit the canvas very hard. He was knocked out as soon as Double the punch landed. Double jeopardy. He was unconscious from the moment he caught that shot. Goes to the canvas in the proverbial heap. And boom. Out of our camera range at that angle, the head pounded against the canvas.
Here's another look. So Floyd Mayweather made his statement on a podium this morning, saying, I'm back and I'm still the best. Manny Pacquiao makes his statement right here in the ring. He knocking out Ricky Hatton. And now, the new IBO in ring magazine, late welterweight, champion of the world, Pac-Man Pacquiao. This is Manny Pacquiao or something else. I'm just thinking, since he landed here when he fought the guy from Savio Ledwa, and since he came here, I mean, all of the great fights he's been in, it just I'm just thinking about him, Morales, Barrero, and, and, and the Marquez, and De La Hoya. Uh, and now this fight will be a fight. Three and with all, Morales. All, yeah, a legendary Two wars. Two with Barrera. Two from, with Marquez. Amazing career. He is the pound-for-pound pound champion, as far as I'm concerned, because he's earned it the hard way from 122 pounds up to 140 pounds. He has inducted anybody. Can Manny Pacquiao live up to the flattery of being called this generation's Henry Armstrong. Once again, we got the answer. Indeed. Mm -hmm.